The drama surrounding the breakup between Nollywood actor Prince Eke and his ex-wife Mooma G is yet to come to an end as the feud between the two has arisen again. Yes, you heard right. Actor Prince Eke drags ex-wife Mooma G for allegedly dragging him for PR to drop a new single. I don't even know if these two, Prince Eke and Momaju, wants to trend again or they are busy dragging each other by watching their public learning on the public by dragging each other. Anyways, welcome to my channel where my only obligation is to bring to you celebrity news updates using sliding photos and video clip content of your favorite celebrities simply for information values and entertainment purposes. Fasten your seatbelt and get your favorite chill drink and let's hear the tales of Mama G and Prince Eke's crushed marriage. Some old interview we are recently recycled. We are former popular musician Mama G took a swipe at her ex-husband actor Prince Eke. This is response with receipts. He begs her to move on and stop trying to use or dragging his name to launch a comeback to the music scene. Prince Eke has taken to his Instagram page to rant and also show proof that his wife lied to tarnish his image in the year 2018. In a series of messages shared on his page, the ex-wife of the actor Mama G was seen apologizing to Prince for lying against him and also for tarnishing his image. In one of the messages, it read, I gave you my hard-earned money to push your career and you turn around, use my money to pay journalists for interviews and you are taking a swipe on me for a publicity stunt. How do you sleep at night? God no be man no. I didn't delete this message. Oh. It's still here. It's still here. For two years, I didn't delete it. See, um, I didn't delete it. This is your message. See, I'm see the date. Actor Prince Eke continued, this is the attention you needed to drop your single abby. Here you go. I pay your house rent, pay your electricity bills, pay DSTV, take care of my kids' school fees, etc. Not complaining because it is my responsibility. Sponsor their music video two years after divorce, yet you paint me black at every given time. Two weeks ago, you approached me for a loan to push your project. I gave it to you to help your career. Now you used my money to pay journalists to grant interviews and was taking a swipe on me for publicity stunts so you can drop your single. I still have the agreement we signed for the loan. No, I beg hapo no maakano kedihem meregi. You claim to put your career on hold for me. How? In 2013, I sponsored their music video. Playing the victim won't sell your market. I have moved on long time ago. Please move on. Free me. In 2016, you said you walked away because I proposed to four women in America. In 2020, you are now saying I walked away. That's one thing with lies but the internet never forgets free me asking to stay calm and at the same time you guys are calling me unpretable names i have been silent for 10 years let the world know and judge me finally i lost an endorsement with a delta airlines in the year 2018 because of domestic violence was attached to my records on google courtesy of the woman i still found it tomorrow i hear all are calling me names because i spoke up Prince Eke then finally uploaded the picture of himself and his three children with the hashtag moved on, move on a beg. Oh geez, cloud chasers. <laughs> And this is the particular interview that is causing this public fuse between this ex-couple concerning their marriage. The topic said, it was a huge disgrace that my marriage failed, said singer Momaji. But before continuing on the interview, is this the first ever video you are watching on my channel and peradventure? Your love for entertainment attracted you to my beautiful channel, if you start world. Kindly please 
promote and publicize my channel by simply clicking on the red icon down below to subscribe to my channel and endeavor to do turn on the notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button its function is to always notify you once i upload a new video you'll be the first to watch like share and your comments will appear in the comment section first <music> Speaking about the interview, singer Momaji has opened up on her failed marriage to Nollywood Prince Eke. Speaking about the interview, the mother of three said, I believe that one of the duties I have to fulfill here on earth is motherhood, and that includes getting married and building a family with a partner. In fact, where I come from, we do not believe in divorce or separation. Couple with my Christian background, it was a huge disgrace that my marriage failed, but God in heaven knows I did my best and the fault wasn't from me. If you have two partners and one wasn't ready to settle down and per adventure you got involved and you are willingly to sacrifice everything to make sure them have family works but this partner just picks his bag and says i am done with this stage of my life i am going kids or no kids i was so shocked i call it the eighth wonder of the world i never dreamed or imagined a situation where i who has been so committed and was being treated so shabbily and the most devastating part of faith was to have built a career for years which I put on hold just to kickstart something. And this person wakes up one day and says, look, I can't go on with this. Then I got the shocker of my life when I read in the news that I was flourishing with different men. That was the ultimate bullshit. I have always been a reserved person. I may look crazy and wide on the outside, but for a man to come up with such lies is outrageous. I have never drunk alcohol nor prostituted since I was born. And even as a single woman, I never messed around with men. I have always been a focused person and then suddenly someone is saying all these lies against me it was a campaign of calumny he did not just say that he went online and posted it just to then the image i have built over the years it was so so crazy <laughs> what was coming but i tried for six years to make it work i gave up my career i gave up all i had built over the years to become a full-time housewife it is enough sacrifice for somebody to say thank you if i weren't a good submissive housewife you would have long heard the story it is quite unfortunate that he decided to carry out a campaign of call me against such a person that gave up her career just to build a home with him in the sight of man and god if knees could peel based on prayers man would have sauce because i I prayed ceaselessly for my marriage to work. I thank God I am not barren. God gave me three kids, she said. When I had my twins, a woman based in USA called Gina sent me a friend request on Facebook and I accepted. Then she sent me her naked pictures and my ex in bed. My ex has proposed to this same woman on a Valentine's Day, April of the year. I was delivered of a set of twins and the pics went viral. This lady ran mad and looked for me on social media. The street I lived in Port Harcourt is named after me. The woman told me that a woman on that street gave birth to a child that my to my husband she sent me picture of the baby i also heard that he slept with most of the actresses in nollywood especially the upcoming ones but i didn't care i wanted to keep my home i had been in pain all through the years i was married he had an affair with the dco of the police station in the area we lived in but court the two of them used to wear the same attire to attend police functions everybody feared the policewoman was the wife of my ex this dco is even married woman just imagine <laughs> celebrity divorce story there are three sides of the story her side his side and the truth and it is a wrap on today's celebrity news update if you actually want prince eke and mama g to reconcile then put them in your prayers at least let them come back together for the sake of their children and i am going to conclude today's celebrity news update with the reactions of their fan on social media and i am going to see you in my next video upload and until then it is love and light from my end remember constructive criticism compliment and correction is what i desire to see in my comment section and bye bye thank you for watching Thank you.